Hello, I'm Gunther. I know games, I play games. And today we're gonna do another fun run where I will first I'll figure out how my keys work. Um so so far we looked at the shadow and the Ronin to kind of go over a day six how-to. Um this character, this setup always taunts me because I like crossbow. But this is the better setup. Because <laughs> you get smoke bomb already. So and we all know smoke bomb's pretty OP, hence we're using it here because it comes to the character. But um it's just really necessary to get you out of sticky situations. And I honestly love this character shove because it's just solid. Like next to the throw, it's just, oh, it's so good. The throw thing is still my favorite, even though they kind of operate in the same way. I just feel like, I don't know, the throw just seems really cool. Um, we'll take bow staff. So right now we're not really in a direction for how we want to do a build. Uh, we're just going to walk up to him and not do that. Um, okay. So we're going to kill this guy. Run. Smoke bomb. Give him a good shove. The plus with shove is, it's really good for creating breathing room. So that you're not, like, stuck. Kill that guy. You wait. Uh, we want to stop him from going forward. Okay. Okay. So we want to get this guy to kill the guy back there for us. Just so we have, like, less issues. We smoke bomb our way out of there. We just do this. Turn around. Shove this guy. Run. Stab them both. Uh, we don't quite have lethal, so I'm not gonna. We might want to go in the direction of getting the more damage from attacking from behind, because because of bow staff. Uh, poison, I like that on the spear, just because then we can poison at least two people. Or at most two people, I should say, not at least. Um, so you know he wants to do nonsense. We have the bow staff as well, which puts us in a really good position. Get them both. Turn them around. Okay, he's going for the dash again. We just smoke bomb. We just wait. Shove him away. Like, we have really good um, utility here. So this should be, if I don't mess it up, a good run. Um, I'll get more damage on the bow staff just because I want to kill things faster with it. And we'll go combo shop. And I don't know where I want to go after that. Um, more poison would be nice. Combos give money. I'm just going to play in the long run. I kind of want this. I'm going to sell health to get it. It seems like a bad idea, but it could work out for us. I'm going to go here and debate if we're going for the combo shop or not. Okay. So we have to get rid of this guy now. Him not being an elite is great for us. Okay. So we're going to smoke bomb here. We just don't care. Poison. We run. Have him do the work for us. Run. Let's get rid of this guy. Um, Go forward. Just shove him into him. I think we just wait for another shove. Nah, we just have. Because I want to get rid of the archer anyway. So that just works out. Get them both. I have to also remember we have the combos give more money. I don't like this position, so we're going to do this to get out of it. I'd rather not have to use an item, but I also enjoy not, you know, dying. Stab him, smoke bomb, combo. We're at an okay amount of money. Um, I don't really like either of these options. I'm going to greed roll. These are both amazing. I'm going to take the gun, though, because it's my favorite. Uh, this comes back to my thing of saying, uh, sometimes you get lucky. With this character, honestly, it's mainly just the same as everyone else is positioning. But the shove really does help a lot. Like, I can't overstate how good the shove is for just getting you out of bad situations. Hmm... I'm going to do this, put him in there, and run. 
do that. He dies to poison. We run. Um. Sometimes I think they've kind of alleviated, not alleviated, but lightened up some of the difficulty in the game. It's still pretty hard, but I feel like you don't. I haven't ended up as many um bad scenarios where like the spawns are just completely against me. But that's not to say that they aren't still there. I've just somehow avoided them. Uh, another thing I could go over is um what I'm doing here. As long as they never get to do their move, they will continue to stay in that loop. He got out of it there because uh just happened to be how it worked out there, but we don't really care. Because we just skipped all of his mechanics. This works except for on curse bosses. Um I don't know if I want this. I'm gonna skip. Because we don't want to spend more money there. Um both these options are really good. We'll go worrying. But yeah, it, pretty much, if they're not cursed, as long as you keep your distance from them, backstab is what we were talking about, um, you can avoid all of their mechanics, but if they're cursed, then they break out of that loop and say, hey, I'm going to start doing cursed things, like beams. Um, okay. I honestly really do like the addition of cursed enemies. I think, sorry, cursed bosses with the elites. I think it's pretty neato uh run um <laughs> but i think it's actually pretty good because um they make me have to think a lot more i'm curious if they're gonna include um making uh what do you call them the shogun corrupt at some point because right now compared to the other bosses when they become elite he's kind of a pushover to an extent um okay we're fine that's a combo. Just because, like, his patterning doesn't change on the hard difficulty, so you're not really thinking, like, how do I get around this character? You're more so just like, how do I just burn through his first phase? We'll just run. Um, do this. You notice one bad habit I have is, like, queuing up tiles that I have no intent of using. It's just kind of one of those, like, worst case scenario kind of doodads. Um, I think we go for Spear here so we can get the combo. And we get some damage on this guy. Let's turn him around. Um, okay. So I'm gonna do Spear, Gun. Turn around. I know we could um, use Smoke Bomb, but I don't really want to. Because I want to save a position like this where we're like trapped. So now we can do Turn Around, Shoot him, and get the extra damage. He's gone. Um, I'm honestly happy we got the Wanderer out of the way. I feel like the Shadows probably gonna be the hardest character to do with, even though I don't like. I like them more than the Wanderer, but it's mainly just because like their positioning is really wonky to the point that it can really um determine. It can change how you want to tackle getting items. Because some items just intrinsically feel different for that character. Stab, stab him, shoot him. Um, okay. And the thing I was thinking about kiting enemies also works on the regulars. If he never reaches me, he never does his attack. Which is a good thing for us, bad thing for him. Stab, shoot. Okay, we want to get rid of this guy. So I'm trying to think, do we just do spear? I'm going to say we do spear turnaround so we get the combo. Shoot this guy. There are tons of items on the ground. We might need to use one here. So what I'm thinking is we freeze them. Shove him. And then do that. It's not elegant, but... That's what we had to do. Plus, there's any of the items in the ground. I'm gonna drop a shield for the turnaround move. Sorry, mirror. Because I can see this coming in handy. I don't really want more cooldown. But we have enough gold where we can reroll. I want less cooldown, yes. That I do. Okay. This is not bad. So we do that. Smoke bomb him. Turn him around. Shove him. Shoot him. Bait that. Um, shoot him again. Nope. 
Stab him. Shoot him. Smoke bomb. Uh, shove. Gun. Gun can trivialize things, but we're gonna hit a point where it's gonna be a little dashy. I said dashy because I'm hoping we're dashy. Uh, dicey because of uh, the exploding enemies. I'm trying. I'm tempted to pick another smoke bomb. I might take dash here. So we have one smoke bomb. That might be a silly choice. That might bite me in the ass later, but we'll see. Um, can push in either direction. Mono is really good. These are both probably what I'm picking up. And I don't want to sacrifice anything. If I wasn't sacrificed, I would sacrifice a dash. I feel relatively safe going down here with this build, only because I only have two things they might take, and I I'm gonna regret it actually. Uh, the more I think about it, this is a bad decision. Blow them up. Smoke bomb. Do that so they can't spawn behind us. Do that. I mean, the plus with the spawny dude is uh, he also spawns them with just enough health that they can normally just die to him. So we do this. Um, we'll do that. Shoot him. I have to remember we have Monomancer because I forgot there. And that kill kind of happened by mistake. I'm not going to lie to you. Shove him. Shoot. Smoke bomb. He's just going to curse us, but I don't want to get cursed. But I don't have to. Um, Reroll. I think we're at the point now where we have enough gold coming in from combos. We can be greedy with rerolls. We should not have to increase our cooldown at all. That is, uh, increasing your cooldowns is not cool, so let's not do it. Um, funnily enough, I don't see when we're going to really use dash, because now we're going to let all the enemies that, like, want to approach us, and we don't want to approach them. Just shove him. Clear the board. Um, poison him. Actually, no, just kill him. So we do this. Ah, that was weird. It's fine. Turn around. Shoot him. Okay. Smoke bomb. Shove. This is why I love shove, because it's just versatile south of that kind of situation. So now we can use dash, stab, and then shoot. We get a lot out of that. Um, Shoot him. I think with our setup right now, we're doing really well. Uh, more damage on this. I want this to be like our our boomstick. Just get rid of enemies. I don't want to look at them. Blow the sky up. Um, we just shoot him. Okay. We shove. I'm going to shoot him now. Kill. Shove him. Um, we shoot, we use the dash that I said we wouldn't need, because now it's all of a sudden incredibly necessary, rerun. This is why you never say any tile's bad, because it'll come bite you in the ass and you make a video about it and be like, oh well, actually, this tile's amazing. So you know she wants a dash at us, so we'll just get something prepared to knock her away from us. Um, we'll do this. So we can just turn around, get extra damage twice, and she can't really do much about it. Uh, we're gonna shoot her. She's like half health already. Okay, we have this. Got it. Dash, stab, shoot. Okay, we're in a good place. Um, I like knockback punch. And. We could actually just gamble knockback punch to be something even better. Warring gets us a lot of things that would be nice. You know what? I go to Warring in case we get the one that gives us more damage after moving. We did not get it, but we got close combat. And the arrow. We could reroll here, but I feel like these are fine. If we reroll here, we could sell blood. We'll reroll. I just want to see what we get. Backstabber. Another backstabber would have actually been really good. Um. We sell this, we use that, we're at five. We need five more gold, 
No, we can't buy. Never mind. Ignore me. My math was terrible. Uh, get rid of this guy. We can't take our guns. We have it. This is where things get a little scary. Smoke bomb. Shoot him. Please get rid of him now. Shoot him. Uh, as previously mentioned, never get trapped between two little guys. It's a uh, bad times. Shoot him. Punch him away. Um, does this kill? Yes. I mean, of course it was killed. Oh, we don't care. You can have that. We, we really don't care if you take a tile that, like, just turned us around. It's the gun and the smoke bomb I'm worried about. Free to play, smoke bomb. Making that a free to play means you have your get out of jail free card. Uh, no. And. Okay. I don't like this. Smoke bomb. Blow that guy up. Punch him. Shoot him. Shove. Um. This is fine. We mainly want to kill the guy behind him. I'm gonna shove. Because the problem is. If I use smoke bomb there. This is fine. If I use smoke bomb there. Sorry. If I. Punched him, he would die to close combat. That's what I was trying to say. My brain was just mush. Um, more cooldown the smoke bomb. Also, when we're doing those single moves, we're getting model mancer and sniper triggering, which is kind of crazy. We just shoot him. We should also still be going for combos, honestly, but no, there's no but. I should just be going for combos. Uh, let's we'll shove him again. Dash, stab, combo. Get a punch off. What's he doing? Knockback punch. I'm gonna turn. Because I realized if I did this, he was gonna hit us in a way that I wouldn't like. Um shoot him. Okay. Punch him backwards. And just shoot him. Yeah, we almost end up in a very bad situation there. I'm just gonna shoot him. I'm gonna dash up to this guy, and punch him, and then get rid of him. Um, I'm scared. Okay, I'm not scared anymore. He took the, the tile I don't care about. So wait, hear me out. We do dash, dash, stab, shoot. That was not the last enemy. Why did I think it was the last enemy? Okay, so we're in trouble. Because he wants to shoot. We smoke bomb, we just go here. We have to shield. Kill him. I didn't mean to stand there. That was me. That was me messing up. Uh, we just dash up and stab him. Yeah, that was, uh, that was our first hit of the run, too. That was just me making a grand mistake. Hopefully we don't pay for it. Um, heavily. Um, we're fine. We just shoot him and teleport. Unfortunately, we can't shoot him here. Um, we do this because we want to do it before this guy gets to do his stuff. We'll shove that into him. Oh no! That's my fault. I forgot he has instant move. How I forgot that? Don't have an answer for you. Really don't. Okay. We don't care about what he took. I almost put myself in a bad position there. Which is pretty on brand for me. So here's the problem. So, we smoke bomb here, stab these two, shoot the last guy? So we have to be standing here. 
That way we don't get hit by our own knockback. Um, we just dash up and punch this guy. He dies to the extra damage. We shove him. Back up. Run. Uh, we run again. We smoke bomb. We run. Go here. Run. Okay, are we trapped in a, in a thing? No, because we can shove him here. Okay. We wait. We have to kill him one at a time. It's not fun, but it saves us. And he has a gun. Okay, I didn't think about that. Um, So we need to be very careful here. And by very careful, I mean I'm just going to do it. I'm going to kill the guy in front of us. Him taking smoke bomb hurts us. Do I shield one damage? I'm going to shield one damage. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is actually great for us. Stab him. Shoot him. I hate having to use a health uh, shield there, but I don't want to get hit again. Um, upgrade slot? Yes. Remember I was saying about everything going really well? This is where things go the opposite. Um, more damage. These are both... Well, we want this. We don't really want the unfriendly fire as much. Uh, we'll get this. Get even more damage on the gun? Sure. It'll be good for the bosses. Um... Yeah, that's kind of it. Prob enemies behind us. Get rid of him. We'll also be good for enemies like him. Poison him. Okay. We do that. Run. I'm just gonna shoot him. Dash up, punch him. So we need to just kill this guy. So we do this. Turn him around. Dove. Get rid of both of them. There's a health item there for us. I love it. There's two of them actually. Um He's back up, dash, punch him. I feel like shooting is unnecessary for this guy. So let's do this. I don't want to punch him, because he'll get knocked backwards, and that's not good for us. Well, I want to punch this guy. That guy I'm okay with punching. We can shoot him from there, we're safe. Okay. That's fine, turn him around. Shoot him. Okay. Um, get rid of this guy now. Punch him. He's dead. I'm gonna do dash shoot. Just so I don't take damage from the... The approach. Uh, punch him. I don't like this. Okay, because we have to kill these two guys. Which doesn't look great for us we could just stab him like do this this he tries to throw at us we do smoke bomb he dies because of distance oh yeah okay yes of course according to plan all according to plan i knew it from the start never never question it in my heart <laughs> uh he needs to be in the light we shove him that was actually a little dangerous in case he decided to shoot us. That was a mistake on my part. I thought we were fine. We were in fact not fine. Shove him. Uh, stab. Damage. He has so much health. Um, punch him. Shoot him. Uh, he wants to approach us. We're gonna smoke bomb him. Okay, so we stab, shoot. Turn around, punch him away. The turn around part's completely unnecessary, but hey, I'm doing it. 
Okay. He's dead. Shoot him. It's directly in front of us. Oh, uh, we do this. And then shoot him. Okay. We're fine. Uh, we want to heal and buy a health item so that, you know, I can make up for my mistakes. I don't want perfected strike. It's not going to help us where we're going. Uh, when we take damage, we get a shield. Yes. Shields persist across fights wouldn't be bad with that, but we don't need it as much as we need a health item. Okay, so this is the part where we gotta lock in. Um, so we dash, stab him both, he dies to poison. I really wanna kill the guy behind us, but I should really kill this other dude first. Smoke bomb. Shove him. Um, we can just walk up and stab them both. Mm. Okay, so I don't want to take damage from using the gun and knocking back into this guy, but I really need these guys gone. Do I smoke bomb? Shove? Gun? Um, We could just walk forward here. We don't have to do anything fancy. Turn around. Shoot him. Smoke bomb. Back up. Um... I did this wrong. We're taking damage. Yeah, that was on me. We're taking damage there. I realized a little too late that we were gonna eat some damage off that one. Shove him. Okay, so we dash up, stab, shoot. I don't like the guy in front of us. Smoke bomb. I'll break my shield. It's fine. Dash forward. Hit them both. Smoke bomb. Thank goodness. That could have gone really poorly. Kind of like this is. Um, this is fine. Okay. We're still not even to find a wave yet. They're still sending dudes. I hate it. Uh, we're gonna prep this. I'm gonna stab him. Shoot this guy. We got two more waves to go. This wave is fine as long as we can. We have to solve for the dashers. We shove. We smoke bomb. Okay, we're fine. We spear. Okay, boss time. Uh, double strike, don't you tempt me. Double strike on the gun? Like 14 damage, but 6 cooldown. I'm gonna say double strike on the punch. I feel like double strike on the thing is just gross. Um. Okay. Shoot him. Smoke bomb. Oh, you suck. Um. Dash, stab, turn him around. You just run. I want to take punch him. Punch him. Run someone behind us? Do we care? I think we kind of do. I'm gonna smoke bomb our way out of there. And bait that out. Poison him. Run. Okay. We shoot him, then smoke bomb. We're fine. I'm gonna dash and just shoot him oh okay um pop the shield early actually no we didn't need to pop the shield early because we're gonna get one for um well for being stupid there but we'd get one for getting hit the first time um but don't worry about that anymore i decided i just wanted to get hit early i guess dash up stab him shoot him he's got barely any health he dies smoke bomb Okay, um, yeah, so, same as the other character. I got hit less this time. That's a plus, right? Uh, but yeah, a lot of it did come down to luck with my tiles, but kind of picking out which tiles work best for you in the situation, and then getting good boons, because the boons are honestly what saved us. 
I would say this one did decently, Backstabber did decently, like, everything here kind of carried weight. We didn't really use this as much, but we got near the end. And I didn't really use this as enough because I always forget about it. So I remember the coin getting me money, but not the heal. Go figure. Uh, but yeah, if you like it, please subscribe and come back for more. See ya.